Hey and welcome to another tutorial about movie making in games. Well, this time it's only gonna be about E.T. because it doesn't work in any other game. But uh, yeah, let's just get started. I had some requests um, from some guys asking me like, how do you change the fonts in uh, like the console? Like you killed that guy and that guy got killed by blah blah blah. You know, the console and the font uh, changing it. Well, there's some programs for it. And uh, I'll I'll show you now. First, go to the site myhannes.info without www. Don't forget that. And then this site will pop up and click on the software. And there we have it. This is the Movie Maker, the UV Movie Maker Gold. Well, it isn't gold, but um, this is the UV Movie Mod. And the mod allow it's like um, ET Pro J Mod or ET Pub. It's just a mod and you're selecting it before you um, yeah you put your demos in that mod I already told you guys about it if you remember but just uh, to let you know um, yeah click download well, open it or download no problem. okay this is the, the UV movie maker well I'm not gonna install it all again but uh, this is the movie mod and um, yeah the mod is pretty important Okay, there it is. Okay, this is this. Um, yeah, just open it, and there you have it. This UV movie mod. You can just copy it, or Control C, or copy, of course. Go to your uh, Wolfenstein folder, your movie Wolfenstein, of course. Don't forget that. And there it is. I already copied in here, and then it should look something like this. Well, you don't need that cam things. It's just for cam trace and some extra things, but. Uh, don't mind that. I didn't say that. Uh, after you did that, the mod is installed. That's good. And then you go to the other thing, the movie maker. If you install that and everything, this should pop up. And uh, this is where you can change the font and the hood and everything uh, with a new uh, thingies uh, fonts. You go to settings, uh, program settings first. Go. Um, yeah, you should uh, locate your et.x here go search well shouldn't be a problem I think just link it to where your movie ET is located change mod to UV movie mod of course and uh, yeah that's about it click OK and then uh, here's where the magic happens you can change the the hood and the console font here and the console is uh, yeah the big thing on the left side uh, in your upper left side of the screen and your, the hood is for um, the you killed standing in the middle of the screen and um, if you want to change that for a new font go to uh, options and uh, click hunt and hurt or font change and there you have it all the all the fonts you have on your computer you can download new ones just um, Google forum uh, oh, maybe I got a nice site for you here look for free fonts or something well, well. Anyways, I'm not going into this because uh, you can just find it yourself. Um, yeah, um, click one. Uh, okay, maybe you think this is nice. What's well, ugly? But doesn't matter. Uh, click on ultra quality, of course. Highest quality, best, best, best. Uh, click on create valid uh, PK3 file and copy directly to media library. Okay, if that's selected, click convert. And if you did that. Um, well you can change the console thing as well and click one uh, all the same thing um, and then go to the home panel again and uh, the font you could just create it or select it uh, will be in this list and yeah you can select one and click apply and after that select this one and apply as well uh, this is the ET demo player uh, you shouldn't worry about this because uh, it doesn't even show my demos in uh, in here, but uh, don't mind it. Uh, okay, so after that, I'll show you now some useful commands in the game itself. Okay, so you want to start up your oh, there it is. Okay, this is my uh, ET. I'll put a small screen for you because we need to change some things. Okay, first of all, mod. Pretty important, of course, the UV movie mod. Uh, yeah. 
don't have to explain that I guess there it is my demo just randomly uh, chose one but um, okay I'll let that load uh, meanwhile um, it's important to uh, have two convicts and I'll explain now um, one convict is for um, getting all the messages from the console away and one uh, convict is for uh, showing all the pop-ups all the time because if you noticed in my frag movies um, my console the um, blah 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 got killed by Musashi uh, stays all the time it stays uh, 99999 uh, it never ends so it only my frags show up in the console and my frags never disappear in the console so you can always see it it's yeah it's nice I think you'll you guys all know what I mean if not I don't know what to say just uh, do what I say it's look nice um, anyways uh, one is for um, showing the console and it's it's looking like this and I'll put the the whole uh, config at the right side on YouTube again so you can just copy it into your um, ET main because that's where the convicts are located if you didn't know already shame on you uh, anyways if you have those two convicts in your ET um, on the end of every convict it says bind M or N and on access to the next convict so one or two I call them one for um, showing the frags and two for let them disappear and I'll explain now why you have to look um, if you see I hope you can see it on this quality of my screen recorder but three um, messages are on the upper left side of my screen uh, telling me uh, how much frags I made and they're they're not disappearing I can just see them all the time but it's pretty annoying if you want to have a frag recording or you want to record a frag and the old messages are still popping up Th that's just ugly we don't want that so if I push N and that's for the uh, deleting uh, the console if you remembered then my puppets disappeared and now I push M so from now on, all the pop uh, the pop-ups uh, will show up again and never disappear. So I think you know what I mean now, because uh, just if you want to start recording, push N and M again, and then from uh, from that point, the the pop-ups will never disappear. So yeah, just record till you're happy, till you're satisfied with your frags and. Yeah, then close the game and you have only the frags never disappearing nice 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 I think you all got it I don't I'm not gonna talk anymore about this anyways um, I think that's the main uh, part about the UV movie mod the most exciting thing about it and um, yeah that's what a lot of people wanted to know and as you can see the the font is changed the you killed uh, and he was killed by that guy's Thompson so um, yeah, if you have any questions, because uh, it was a bit fast tutorial, um, I'm a bit of a hurry now, but uh, yeah, just just leave a comment or something. I'll just explain it, but it isn't that hard. If you if you know uh, what I'm talking about, it's so easy. But you just need to know it for a second. So um, yeah, that's about it. Um, for more um, comments, uh, what you can do with the UV movie mod, like a Counter Strike console, but I'm not going into that because. I'm really tired and um, yeah if you want to know more about it just read the tutorial on the site itself uh, there are some nice um, yeah, packages involved with all the all the commands that can be used and remember um, all the movie mod commands are starting with slash mm starting movie mod mm and then uh, I don't know these are all movie mod commands anyways uh, I'm off I'm gonna sleep now so uh, yeah, you guys enjoy the tutorial and for any questions just leave a comment. Enjoy!